Hi everyone, Argolfump here, playing Detective Barbie 3. I'm getting a little frustrated here because I have to play this bottle mini game. I need to win this bottle mini game, and it is just not a hey, game Mom. that I am good at winning. Teresa just keeps defeating me, like no tomorrow. Don't let those bottles get away. I'm gonna try this strategy. Yeah, got one. That worked. Oh no, we're tied. The strategy of putting my net right over Teresa's did net. Did you see what that fish did to my net? Yeah, putting my net right over her net seems to help because that way she can't possibly... Another bottle. That way I'm stealing bottles from her, if that makes sense, we right? We got one! Okay, so thankfully that one fish destroyed Teresa's uh -oh, net. don't forget to avoid the... That one fish destroyed Teresa's net, so that stopped her from getting a bottle, so I was cool. able to get a bottle. Another bottle! So that put me one ahead of her. I'm just one ahead of her. Uh-oh, no, 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 no. Teresa, you're not yeah, taking that bottle. One. There we go! Yeah, stealing bottles from her. Cool! Another bottle! Okay, now I'm up we by... We got one! Now I'm up by two! What? How is how is this possible? You rock! Oh, I'm only up by one now. Okay. 45 seconds left. We are down to the end of the championships. Teresa versus Barbie. Got it. Yeah, got one. Oh, yeah! Okay. Cool! Another bottle! Got another bottle here. Got one right after she we did. We got one! Oh, got a green one really at the top this. of the screen. Ooh, getting this green yeah, one. got one. But then Teresa gets a yellow. I mean, she gets a blue one at the exact same time, negating my lead. I'm still, I'm two ahead. Cool. I move my net right in front of hers bottom. here. It's a lot easier if you do this yeah, as a two-player uh, game and just play this, cool. this as a two-player game because all you have to do is... Uh-oh, we've run out of time. Congratulations, player one. You've caught the most bottles. Hip. This in one of the bottles. It looks like a map and an old key. We need to put this in the gadget bag. So yeah, all you have to do is have player number one win. Therefore, it would be easier to do this challenge, not against the computer, but against a player number two. That makes sense, right? So we found some sort of treasure map. Booyah! Treasure map. Treasure map. So, uh, let's go back to the beach and actually use the treasure map. I think we need some equipment first. Here we go. Yeah, we need this shovel. I wonder who left this spade here. Spade, not a shovel. This spade might come in handy. We need... So let's set treasure up... Treasure map and this key... Compact and brush. So let's get these things Compact all... spade. This spade. Compass. A compass is a device used by sailors to tell them which way they're going. Sorry, I kind of skipped over their explanation of what these things are. So I've, I've got all three of these things here. I've got the compass, I've got the map, and I've got the, the spade. So, I should be able to find the treasure with all of these clues. Let's check what the map says. From the pink rock, go three steps west. Three steps west. So that's one, two, three, dig. Right? There doesn't seem to be anything buried here. Try another spot. Let me use the compass to make sure I'm actually going west. Oh, does the compass change depending on my position? No, I don't think it does. One, two, three. I think the compass is just showing. Oh, there doesn't seem to be anything buried here. This is just trying to show where where West is. Do you think the key We got is it! Yeah, it's right at the X. Look, here's the stolen painting. We got 
it. We recovered the stolen painting. We've got the first stolen piece of art. And make sure Ken keeps an eye on us. Yeah, we're amazing. We're amazing. We found the stolen piece of artwork. Uh, two more. Good job, Barbie. That's the missing painting. Where did you find it? We found it buried in a treasure chest on one of the island beaches. Oh, Ken doesn't have anything to say to that. He's just like, oh, that's amazing. Where did you find it? It's like, oh, it was buried in a treasure chest. Trip. Cool. Cell phone scam. So let me get this the, cell uh... phone is the best way to keep treasure map and imp treasure map and compact and these items can be used for finding tri uh, info this so let me just get these three things uh my three normal uh gadgets back into place so i found my three normal gadgets now uh i didn't find them anyway my three normal gadgets i've got them now so i can use them and uh, solve the mystery sure so Culprit left a fingerprint, right? Culprit always leaves a fingerprint on the artwork. So let's get this fingerprint. Cool, another fingerprint. We're all over this case. We are, we are totally over this case. So, four fingerprints now. Two Use more. the directional buttons to highlight the... And as I've indicated, we'll find the other two fingerprints on the other two pieces of artwork. So, let's go back. Let's, let's, let's go to the artwork. I should say, let's go to the islands. There are three islands in this game, right? So, every single island has its own puzzle containing a piece of artwork. We just, we just solved island number one's puzzle. So, uh, next we'll go to island number two. And then island number three. Okay. So let's talk to Becky while we're here. Hi, Barbie. What do you think, Becky? Is there somewhere else we should check out? Maybe you should go search the waterfall area on the second island. Yeah, so <laughs> Becky's telling us to check out the second island. I find it funny that the islands are named Island 1, 2, and 3, and that's the order you're supposed to go search the islands in. Not really the most creative of uh, island names, I would say. Screen. Use the direction of So, we found a clue that leads us to the second island, just in case you didn't talk to Becky, or you have no idea that the number 2 follows the number 3. Righty then. Shoo doo wop, shoo doo wop, da da da. And that goes to the bridge. I don't need to go to the bridge. I need to go to the pool. There's another, there's another clue. Okay, this clue. Let's check out the two clues. Might as well. I'll check out the two clues, and in the next video, I'll go to the second island. How's that? Can Seems like a good idea, screen. right? Use the direct... Wow, look at this feather. It's beautiful. Look at all those colors. This feather has come from a... Birds like this live in rainforests. looks like some type of fruit. You're right. Mango. Mangoes grow in trees and love tropical climates where there's lots of water. Just like you find by a waterfall. Island number two. Yeah. So all these old clues, th these old clues are now labeled cold. Hmm. I think they're, the trick. They're Press cold. the X button here to look at the map screen. I explained this earlier. 
The old clues, the clues that we're finished with, are called cold clues. They're not called hot clues. And we've also got a map, just in case you want to see what this game looks like. Here's... So here's a map of all the islands. We can't really use the map for anything. It's just nice to look at. It's just nice to look at. To check out the game location screen. And check this out. We haven't actually been to the upper part of the ship. I don't think we can actually... To check out... I don't think we can actually go to the upper part of the ship. I this think we're trapped here on the bottom of the ship. Press. On the on the bottom. And these are all the various locations. Check it out. You can check out all the locations in this game. It's beautiful. Superior cabin, 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 cabin. Okay, these cabins are clearly all the same thing. <laughs> okay, so next video, next video, island number two.